Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome in. If you don't know who I am, my name is Fantasy. I'm a variety streamer. I play PlayStation, Nintendo Switch, and PC games. Uh, we're just pretty much here to have a good time. And as long as I make a put so, uh, a smile on someone's face, then I, I I think I did my job for the day. Today we're going to be playing Horizon Forbidden West. If you haven't seen my playthrough of Horizon Zero Dawn, you need to check out my YouTube channel, which you can find here. Uh, I also have a QR code above my head. You're more than welcome to scan it with your phone. It takes you directly to the link tree. But yeah, I have... It's an eight-parter on my YouTube channel. And it was honestly a lot of fun. And I'm honestly really excited to play uh, Horizon Forbidden West. Should be honestly a lot of fun. But I also do have a Discord server. You're more than welcome to join. Uh, we have movie nights every Monday, and we also have TV Thursdays, which currently we're working through Doctor Who, and it, it's honestly a lot of fun. I, I really enjoy movie nights and TV Thursdays. Uh, movies are every Monday, and this coming Monday we're watching The Emperor's New Groove, so it should be a lot of fun. Um, yeah, I've been currently just vibing, having fun. Hopefully everyone's having a fantastic Saturday. But yeah, th this playthrough should also be up on YouTube. Uh, as soon as, of course, I'm done filming it. But yeah, it, it should, honestly, I can't wait to jump into this game. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. So... Uh, I actually do have a, a new part in my uh, Discord channel. It is called Fantasy Reacts. To where you can literally uh, send me stuff to react to. And it will be reacted to live on Twitch. 
of course, it's got to be Twitch appropriate, Discord appropriate. Once you post something in there, it gets checked by my mods or me myself. And yes, since it is a new reaction for me and I'm kind of short on mods, I skim through it just to make sure there's nothing violent, nothing, stuff like that. Number one victory royale. I haven't started yet. <laughs> Welcome in, Peachy. Give you a shout out. If you have not checked out B.I. Peachy, please do. Fantastic person. O honestly, an amazing friend. I couldn't ask for a better friend. They're always there when you need something. Fantastic streamer. Go check them out. They're honestly amazing. Uh, currently, they're... Currently, they're doing Stream Pirates, I think it's called. Stream Pirates. Uh, they play a lot of Jackbox games. They've been playing Stream Raiders, Warzone Stream. Just, now. But yeah, honestly, an amazing person. Can't go wrong with Peachy. So yeah, go check him out. You can call me She, yes. But yeah, welcome in everybody. But yeah, uh Chaotic Me. Ha ha ha. Yeah. But yeah, we're gonna be working through Horizon Forbidden West. I like this song. Yeah, this is from Scooby Doo on Zombie Island. One of my favorite Scooby Doo movies. I I think it's one of my favorite Scooby Doo movies, because I really enjoy The Witch's Ghost. And also, I really enjoy... Hey, I saw that, Peachy. You posted in the general chat. Saw that. Oh, wait, look here, not Discord. Yeah, I, I saw that, Peachy. I saw that. But yeah, uh, we're actually going to switch over to the game scene. And we're going to jump into some Horizon Forbidden West. I think after this song, though. We're going to let this song play through while we're doing the uh, all the settings and stuff. So switch over. Whoop, whoop. All right. So I'm going to deactivate the game scene just to make sure. Oh, actually, we can just do this now. Pause. Pause. Uh, deactivate. Reactivate. Okay. So everything should be linked up. Should be. Don't quote me on that. Uh, let's check. Okay. It is. It is synced. Okay. And again, uh, let me know if any of the volume needs turned up, turned down. Of course, there's no volume right now because it's just the settings. But yeah, let me know if anything needs turned up, turned down. Let me know. Yeah, there's no sounds right now, of course. But, you know. You know how it works. All the mumble jumble. Okay. Speech and movie language. English. Uh... How much contrast we want? Uh, I think 50, yeah. Let's look on screen. I think 45. Adjust the difference, the light, the, the default is 50. I think we're going to keep it at the, the default. Okay. And let's play. Sony Interactive Entertainment presents. Yeah, but hopefully you get that uh the dub in Fortnite Peachy. Sorry, you playing all like shocked. Through a lifetime spent in the pursuit of knowledge, one question consumed me. How did our world come to be? 
The old ones perished a thousand years ago, triggering the extinction of all life. She showed me how it was reborn. Why I do it? A do little it. outcast girl. Ignorant the Rogan Gambit skins look importance. amazing. Through her, I learned that life was only saved through a technological miracle. Zero Dawn. A terraforming system composed of nine subordinate functions. Each playing its part to reshape Earth from a barren rock to a lush landscape. Tended and protected by the machines. And with her, I learned John the, the talk of a dialogue. secret of them all. The secret of her birth. That she is a clone of Elizabeth Subek, Zero Dawn's creator. Born to prevent a new extinction. Driven by Hades, a malevolent AI. Given sentience by a mysterious signal of unknown origin. And with a little help from me. She prevailed in a great battle at the city of Meridian. Becoming a champion for all humankind. Yeah, dad. I'll but as useful dad. as she has been, now. I must leave her behind. For as she strives to put right what Hades sundered, I have made a new discovery. One that heralds both destruction and opportunity. Yes, again, if you have not seen my playthrough of Horizon Zero Dawn, please check out my YouTube channel. It's in the link tree. You can scan my QR code above, or you can use explanation point link tree and go to my YouTube channel. It's an eight part playthrough and it's amazing, fantastic game. I can only imagine this game probably has better graphics, better stuff. I'm super excited to start this game. First time playthrough, let's go. New game. Um. Normal difficulty provides a balanced experience of exploration, story, and combat. Uh, I suck at I suck at combat stuff. So easy dif easy difficulty offers a light combat experience while exploring the world. I, I like that. I like to explore the world. I really do. Uh, what's the story mode? The story difficulty eases the combat experience, allows you to focus on exploration and narrative. Um, what do you guys think? Should I go story or easy? I'll, I'll, leave, I'll leave it up to you guys. See what you guys think. Again, let me know if there's any volume changes that need done. Um, I think we'll go ahead and do... Hmm. I think we'll go ahead and do easy. Uh, assistance Explorer, minimal uh, information. Look at the world to find your way. Markers and icons on the screen. Uh, I need the guided ones. Okay. Alright, here we go. Horizon Forbidden West. I wonder if they fixed the load times, because the load times were outrageous last time. Auto side would take you frequently as you progress. Manual saves may be made at campfires. Okay, I... If you guys remember last time, I'm going to be making a lot of manual saves because of what happened last time. The game corrupted, and I literally had to go back and replay everything. But again, uh, hopefully it doesn't do it on this one, because I would suck ass. Oh, 
Wow, look at the graphics. of a terraforming system that's spiraling out of control. And only I can fix it. Only I have your genetic code. It won't be long before we hit the point of no return. Oh, not the fox. Extinction. I've been searching for months for what I need. A backup of Gaia. The AIU designed to control the system. under a brilliant night sky through a field of flowers and when I arrive at the center I see you Elizabeth waiting for me even though you've been dead for a thousand years you're the closest person I've ever had to a mother these graphics are nuts. And for a moment, I feel whole. I better still have my shield. I'll be pissed if I had to go find lost. my shield. Uh-oh. That's a nightmare, not a dream. I'm always left alone. This world is your legacy, Elizabeth. I won't let it slip away. The valley below is my only remaining lead. My last hope to find the backup. I'll do whatever it takes to get it. I promise. Yep, ah. <laughs> if it isn't Aloy, the savior of Meridian, anointed of the Nora. You know I hate being called that stuff. Well, consider it a punishment for running out on us the very same night we beat Hades. I grew up an outcast. Remember, I'm not much for parties. Yeah. But that one was in your honor. Just saying. So... What are we doing? It must be urgent since you left so fast. Like I said, I'm not going to talk so much because I want to enjoy the story. Delving but uh, into welcome in, everybody. Moons. Hopefully you have a fantastic time enjoying this playthrough with me. Or maybe it has something to do with the Blight. Both, actually. But, um... I, I should... Oh, no. I've been tracking you a long way. It's okay. After everything you've done to help the Nora and my family, I swore an oath to help you. No matter what, you're stuck with me now. Like bark on wood. Hell yeah. 
<laughs> She's so pissed. <laughs> it's like, hell yeah, I, I take him. Okay. But if you're going to come with me, you'll need to be able to see what I see. <sighs> yes, give him mine. Focus. Never thought I'd get your second sight. I'll give you another one later and show you how to back up your data. Data? Information on the device. We've got a lot to cover. Yes, um, give him one. I'll give have him to explain one. everything as we go. You see like this all the time? Since yep. I was a little girl. Come on. This game looks amazing. Shall we? Job, dude. All right, I got a couple of scrapes on the way here. We should find some medicinal plants, stock up. So it's time for your first lesson with the focus. Sounds good. Let's get started. All right, it should be all the same buttons. Better be. These plants don't look like the ones in the sacred lands. The focus helps you see the ones we need. One, two, three. Okay, it's all the same button so far. Hey, Peach Teddy, welcome in. Welcome in. Welcome in. Welcome in. Thank you so much for coming. Hopefully, you're doing well. Having a fantastic Saturday. Those ruins. That's where we need to go. Yes, I know, Aloy. I see a few ways down. Are you gonna jump? Go for a swim? Fastest way down. Uh, what are we after exactly? The backup? Well, um... It's an AI. It's, um... It's hard to explain. Think of it like... A set of instructions that can fix the world. Sounds complicated. Welcome in. Noticed oh, you're uh, steady. traveling light these days. Hopefully, you're having a fantastic yeah, Saturday. Yeah, I um, ran into some right. trouble on the way here. I lost a lot of my gear. Where does that one go? All right. I better not lost my armor. I'll be pissed. How long it took me to get that damn armor? I don't know how to put these ropes here, but we can use the line to slide down. Love this game series. Haven't played this one yet, so I'm gonna peek a little from the corner of my eye. Oh, no worries. Yeah, if uh, you want to check out my playthrough of Horizon Zero Dawn, uh, exclamation point link tree will take you directly to my YouTube channel and all my other sets. You really course. traveled a long way to get here. I almost caught up to you a couple times too. But and you can check out my playthrough of Horizon Zero Dawn. We always were a good tracker. Ground stained red. 
The blight must be infecting the soil. Okay, so is this the... Okay, that's still that. That's still that. Okay, I think it's all the same buttons. Which is good. Box. Salvaging machine carcasses as usual. And there they go. Looks like they left a carcass behind. Okay, instead of blue, it's orange now. This isn't bad. Better take Damn. a closer look. Someone took down this machine recently. Who else would come here? I don't know. We better craft some arrows of our own. There might be trouble up ahead. There's some ridgewood by the stream. All right. Gotta now craft, to craft some some arrows. arrows. Oh, second. I'm getting more shit. Me. This. Okay. And... Okay. Done. Okay. Me too. Arrows ready. I was just ready. But can't reach it from here. Nothing a well placed arrow can't knock free. Just have to target the lock. After you. Got it. By the goddess. What was this place? I don't know. The transmission, we need to find a way in. Ooh, give me that. So, um, what happened after I left Meridian? Well, there was a fuss when people realized you were gone. But then some of us figured you only would have left if it were for something important. You're right about that. The blight's not just poisoning plants. It's killing animals, too. Oh, poor fox. Then people will get sick, too. And starve. We're not gonna let that happen. Collect more of these. So I know I'm gonna need them. Dead end, Aloy. <laughs> we should find another way. Well, let me up there like you. Oh, well, let me up there. Aloy, over here. Maybe we can get into the ruin this way. Okay. Okay. I'm coming. Another one I'm gonna collect, collect, collect. Collect, collect. Down this way. Uh -oh. Get to the grass. Never seen one of those before. Me neither. Oh, look at it. Those dead machines have it on alert. How do you want to handle it? The focus can help us. We can scan the machine before we make our move. Okay. Okay. See how parts of it are glowing? Those are its weak spots. Got it. Okay, concentrate. Up, oh, miss.
that. Take that. Another one's coming. Find anything good? A few supplies. data on the machine like a hunter Hunter's studying its prey yeah kind of kind of all right let me go so after more. the fuss over me leaving what did everyone else do well as soon as the celebration was over my mother led the rest of the Nora home the Sun King put his people to work rebuilding the city and I set out to find you Anything else? There's more wood stuff over here. It's this. Someone shot this machine too. Get this. Get this. Get this. Yeah, I like to I like to collect stuff to so make sure I have enough shit. Another ladder. I need to shoot off the lock. This machine that he say got shot. Oh, over there. You said you've had a focus since you were a child, right? Yeah. I found my first one when I fell into a ruin. Got the others from an old cache not long ago. That's good to have extras. Going into a ruin of the old ones. God has protect us. Anything, uh, okay. you guys want anything fun this Saturday? Through here. To the Far Zenith launch facility. Far Zenith? I, I know they made some tech trades with Zero Dawn, but why would they have a backup of Gaia? Please register with reception for the tour. I guess they want us to check in with them. Yep. I'm gonna play some jackpots for some friends in a bit. For I'm doing Access a little drinking. Denied. Hell yeah. Please wait here for personnel to assist you, Doctor Sobek. Okay. I guess they weren't on great terms with Elizabeth. Well, let's find a way in. Please hold for identity scan. Access denied. Credentials not recognized. I guess it doesn't like me either. Uh, can I go down? I cannot. Okay. I should be able to pry this open. This climbing gear. Guess someone dropped in from above. Whoever left us here might have also shot those machines we found earlier. So where are they now? Up ahead. Ugh. What's that stench? Camp. I doubt. They must have 
come here to delve for scrap. Acid. That explains the smell. And it looks like something big came in from above. Crashed right through the camp. And through the wall. I should take a look at the rubble in that gap. came through here, brought this down as it went out. If I can dislodge some of the debris, we might be able to squeeze through. Maybe I can find something to help in the camp. Aloy, over here. I think I got something. It's some kind of Osram prototype, I think. This hook looks like it can latch onto things. And this gear pulls it back. Hmm. Hmm. Looks broken, but maybe we can repair it. Hook it to the debris. And pull it out. That could work. The focus can help us search the camp and identify anything we can use to fix the tool. My focus picked up a couple of things to check out. Poor guy. Acid burned right through his armor. Part of a machine could help fix the gears. Over there. I said, I'm sorry if I'm a little quiet. Trying to enjoy the story, Sword trying to enjoy the, the game. All right, I think I have what I need to repair the tool. Because this is also my or first time ever playing this game, so better. trying to make stuff, trying to make it a, a good experience for everybody. Okay, so use the workbench. Okay. Craft. A pool caster, okay. Uh, okay, I think I crafted it. There, a uh, pool caster. The pool caster. Now to test it on the debris. Okay, so where? To wield, pull caster, hold. Okay. Okay. See that dent. Hmm. Maybe the pull caster can take out the debris. L2. Tap. L2. Bro, I'm throwing it. L2, tap, R2. Okay, I was I wasn't far enough. Okay, got it. Okay, I need to do it again. Okay. That worked better than I thought. Well, it doesn't look like there's an easy way out of here. 
I should scan the area. We have to find a way to keep going. Huh. What's this thing for? What's this? Whoa. Good morning. I'm Oswald Dalgard, and it is my pleasure to introduce you to Far Zenith. Forget Hopefully everything sounds okay. You know about us. Our truth is simple. We say reach for the stars, even if you have to cross 8.6 light years of space to get there. Please proceed into the auditorium, where we'll unveil our plans. Wonder what's in this auditorium. Guess we'll find out. I should open up my focus display and see what I can find. Bro, I just scanned the damn area. Oh, I might be able to get up there. I don't think I'm doing this right. That's not working. Oh, gotcha. Yep. Wow, that works. That full caster is useful. Too bad there's only one. Don't worry, I'll find you another way up. Tap L3 to sprint, and then... okay. Oh, don't break. Oh, fuck. That was close. Okay, I gotta drop the ladder for Varl. That way now. Hmm. Okay, maybe. Uh oh. There we go. Alright. Let's just go up the ladder.
humans, homo sapiens, us. We have always pushed the boundary as explorers, pioneers, trailblazers. And now Far Zenith is taking the next leap into the future. That's why we're proud to have resurrected the Odyssey. When our government's abandoned in orbit, Far Zenith will actualize in less than a decade. But that's only the beginning. When the ship is complete, we will send the Odyssey and her crew where no one's gone before. Okay. A serious system. There will create humanity's first off-world colony. The Odyssey may take 300 years to reach it. But when we look up at the night sky, we'll know they're on their way. And in the words of our founder, the late Peter Chimbumbe, the truest form of immortality is data corrupt. The playback stopped. The old ones could fly through the sky? Between the stars? Uh, well, yes, sort of. That ship, the Odyssey, it, it never made it to the other star. Something went wrong, and it blew up. Is that why Elizabeth gave them a backup of Gaia? For their colony? Error. Public presentation file corrupted. Member recruitment file available. Do you wish to reactivate? Yeah. Yeah. Reactivate. <laughs> Let's see what else they had to say. We all know the projections. Economic instability, new biocontagions, rampant AIs. How long before another catastrophe creates unacceptable risk for the world's elite? We here at Far Zenith believe, escape the inevitable. And so we reach for the stars. Now you've seen what we're building here. Infrastructure to support the Odyssey's construction. A state-of-the-art data center to facilitate rapid technological advancements. And you've seen how we're managing public perception. So invest and join us. Claim your birth on the Odyssey. Preserve your way of life beyond the concerns of Earth. Well, they were right about the world ending. I just didn't know how... yet. So everything they said back there about the next step for humanity... it was all a lie. These people only cared about saving their own skin. Yeah, well, didn't work out for them in the end. Mm -hmm. That Oswald guy mentioned a data center. There, the backup. It should be stored in there. Won't be able to swim across. I guess we'll have to find a way around. Come on. Okay. No. Usually when they put me... Okay, let me go back here. I still can't believe the old ones could fly. They were capable of a lot of things. For good and bad. Sure seems like it. I wonder what it's like up there, among the stars.
Bro, will you get out of my way? I'm trying to see. Alright, that's probably going to be something I need later on, too. Alright, let's just go and... It doesn't look like we can get across the river here. We'll find a way. Let's keep going. The wilds have really grown over this place. Focus might be able to help here. No, I didn't say do that. I said do this. Thank you. be able to pull that thing out of the wall. Boom. And... some friends from underground. You take the left one. I'll deal with the one on the right. Okay. You better not miss. Hey, cheesy dad. Hook him in. Give you a shout out, buddy. Moving up. I need to sneak up on him to take it out with my spear. Can't let it see me. I should scan it first. Check its patrol path. There's its patrol path. Put it closer and stay out of sight. I can throw a rock to distract it. Get it into a position where I can sneak up and strike. Just have to wait for the right moment. Time to throw. Oh, is that a mission? I okay. I have to literally spot. Oh, okay. just sneak up on it to take it out with my spear. Can't Fine. I should scan it first. Check its patrol path. Okay, there's its patrol path. Get closer and stay out of sight. Yeah. 
can't remember. How you doing, Jesus? Dad? Hopefully, you're having a fantastic Saturday so far. I never had to throw the rock. Oh, there we go. Doing good. Having a slow day. How you doing? Doing pretty good. Just. Relax, I'm playing some Horizon, uh, Horizon Forbidden West, actually. Get over here. Gotcha. Mine's down too. Yeah, hopefully you're having a good day, uh, Saturday so far and currently working our way through Horizon Forbidden West. This is part one. Uh, all, all eight parts of Horizon Zero Dawn are on YouTube. This is Forbidden West. So, what do I gotta go to now? Okay, over here. Okay. So I just gotta search stuff? Okay. More of those machines ahead. Nothing you and I can't handle. Okay. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. I noticed you have a new look these days. <laughs> yeah, I know. Didn't have a lot of time to shave when I was trying to catch up to you. Don't worry, it's not permanent. Good. Sorry my whiskers offend you, anointed. <laughs> I'm sorry my whiskers offend you. Aloy wouldn't like me then, huh? Okay. 
Go over here and get this stuff. We never have too many of these. This little guy got caught up in the blight. I couldn't escape. Oh. I hope it didn't suffer long. The Osram must have used explosives against the machines. They managed to get a couple. Looks like there was a barricade here. The machines must have broken through. Yep. I'll keep this for later. Guess that Osram didn't have a chance to use it. Careful. Traps ahead. Huh. Might be able to disarm them. There. Managed to salvage some supplies. And not blow yourself up. Dismantled it. And not blow yourself and up. Got more supplies. Looks like another camp. While we're here, maybe we can make some traps of our own. Might come in handy against machines. Good idea. I can use this. have what I need to craft a trap. Weak points are. Maybe we should craft some traps. It could help us get by. Okay, so let's craft some traps. This is new. Maybe yeah. we could place one of those it's traps trap in the path. If anything walks into one of those, we won't know what hit it. Bro, you want to get back in the thing? Can't 
Okay, about to walk into the trap. Let's back up. Ah, no, 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 get back in here. The, the audio keeps cutting out a little bit for me. I don't know. Hopefully it's not cutting out for you guys. Let me actually hear Let me do this real fast. Ruins. Deactivate. Reactivate. That's what okay, that hopefully it's not cutting out for you guys. I hope not. That would suck. One second here, guys. Had to check something. All right, so about that. If I can, okay. There's another supply crate. Big storm picking up out there. Yeah. And they're getting stronger. And more frequent. So the storms, the blighted lands, the rivers and lakes choked with algae. You were born to fix all that? Yeah. But I can only do it if I find that backup. I think we're winding our way around to the data center. We'll need to cut through that big building on the right out there. Hey, Varl. There's data here. You scan it with your phone. Mm. This data mentions the tech that Far Zenith traded with Zero Dawn. 
That doesn't explain how they got a backup. I'll keep an eye out for more data. Let's see. Huh. A lot of glyphs. I'll tuck this away to study later. Looks like we've got to climb up. Looks like some kind of meeting room. That door on either side's locked. There's another one of those glowing things by the table. Onzu. The Zero Dawn terraforming system. The brainchild of Dr. Elizabeth Sobek. Empowered by nine subordinate functions, Gaia, the core of the system, is capable of advanced planetary engineering, an obvious advantage to our space colonization efforts. Operation Phase 1. Establish an asset within Project Zero Dawn. Status complete. Phase 2. The asset will secretly beamcast a complete copy of Gaia and her subordinate functions to this facility's data center. If all goes well, Zero Dawn staff will remain completely unaware of the transmission. Risks. Discovery of this operation could result in Zero Dawn withholding the already negotiated Apollo database. Special care must be taken not to alert Travis Tate, the expert hacker in charge of Hades Protocol. In addition, extreme caution must be exercised in regards to Dr. Sobek herself. As one of the world's preeminent technologists, she may have instituted unforeseen security measures. A complete assessment is attached. This concludes the executive summary. I thought Elizabeth sent the backup here, but she didn't. Far Zenith stole Gaia. Aloy, why does that woman look like you? Uh, um, it's okay, Prawl. We look alike because we're the exact same, genetically identical. But she was one of the old ones. How can you be her? Because I wasn't born. I was made. By a machine. It's why I'm motherless, why I was cast out as an infant. I don't understand. What kind of machine can make a person? Remember when I said the backup is like a set of instructions? It's... More than that, it's called Gaia. And for a long time, she cared for the world until she had to destroy herself. So she made me to bring her back. I'm the only one who can. And this place is my last hope. You once said the goddess spoke to you when you went into All Mother Mountain. Was that this? Gaia? Yes, but she's not the goddess, Thoro. There isn't one. How can you be sure? It sounds like she anointed you with a sacred task. I've had a lot of time to figure this out. And you will too, with the focus. But for now, the report said they were going to store the stolen copy of Gaia in the data center. So that's where we have to go. Okay? Search the Gaia back up. Well, get out of the fucking way, dude. Huh. Look at that. Aloy, over here. I found something you could use. A weapon. Thanks, Mo. We should keep moving. After you. A slim shot. Okay. Anything up 
up here. Down here. Am I going to survive that? I think we're almost back outside. Good. Look, that must be the machine. It's heading in the same direction we're going. Great. It's like a giant serpent. I could try to find a weapon on it. Big machine must have attacked as they tried to escape. They didn't stand a chance. All right. So, whoa. So, uh oh. You said this backup is the last hope. Yeah. All those places I've been these last few months. There were supposed to be more backups. But a thousand years ago, a guy named Ted Farrell reached them. Did you try to fight the other two? No. Mm. That was worse. Okay, I cannot go behind the water fire. Saw back in the auditorium. Imagine going up to the stars in that. <laughs> Machines patrolling ahead. We can tag them in the focus to keep track of them.
Okay. Machine ripped right through the wall. Anything else in here I can get? Here. There's a ladder in the back. Okay. Okay. What's in here? Are you good? What's in here? I get around this point now. Okay. 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 Oh, get up there. Okay. So tell me something. Sona was really okay with you not going back to the sacred lands as the nora war chief she understood why i was obligated to follow you but as my mother she wasn't pleased she wasn't pleased is she oh. ever pleased no i don't think i've seen her smile now wow. neither it's like she ever pleased no Slaughtered all those Osram, we'll never get through to the data center. There's no way to slip past them. And they're too tough to fight head on. We could find a settlement, convince some hunters to help us. That would take weeks, and we don't have that kind of time. Maybe all we need is that shuttle to fall. That thing? How? We'll figure it out. Just wait here. Aloy? Yes, wait here. Trust me. And there she goes. Just need to get over to the shuttle to figure out how to make it fall into the basin. Should be able to find a way across to the shuttle.
We just gotta play some stealth. Be suspicious, don't be suspicious, don't be suspicious, don't be suspicious. Suspicious, don't be suspicious. Be suspicious, don't be suspicious. can get me up to the tower. myself off that grapple point. Oh. Didn't get up high enough. I better try this again. Tap, and before you reach the grapple point, got it. Got it. Okay. Getting bad. 
Okay, so I had to go down one more. Okay. So all along, there were three giant machines killing Osiron and leaving acid everywhere. Tower down. On to the next. This fell off. Like that jump. But there is a cable here. Uh... Oh hell no! Well, where to go but up? No oh, hell no! Holding together. No, 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 no. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Hi, um... I'm, I'm sorry, I, I don't speak other languages. I only speak English. But welcome in. Um... Uh, I just did a translation that I, I believe you the the game is playing beautifully looks like there are massive clamps holding the shuttle in place oh, But there's a control console nearby But yeah, I I, I apologize. Uh, I only know fall? English right into the um, basement. So I, I won't be, really be able to understand Excuse me. Sorry about that. Control console might be in there. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry about that. Okay. Time to crush those machines down below. Shadows caught up 
in those cables. I'm gonna have to climb the tower to find a way to disconnect them. What? Now, how to get up the tower? Okay. Scanning with my focus could help here. If I pull that beam down, it might drop the access lift. I'm missing something here. Why do you oh, really? reason I'm not gonna I wasn't be able to shoot it because I was fucking too low. Are you kidding me? Jesus. Oh. Almost 
there. There's the other connector. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Let's see what this can do. It's dead. Finally. The data center should be straight ahead. I guess Farl's gonna have to find another way there. Okay.
down of all the extra stuff. Okay. That's more over here. A beautiful soundtrack. This really is a, like a beautiful game. Servers still running though is the issue. Looks like they are. Sorry about that. I want to make sure I didn't miss anything. Okay. It's here.
This ain't no copy of guy you stole, you losers. But it's the mother of all logic bombs. So good luck repairing your data. And next time you start thinking you can outsmart a tape, remember my salute. Aloy? That sucks. The goddess. There is no goddess. I told you that already. That's not Gaia. That's not what I'm looking for. It's nothing but a fake. sharp bite sometimes you know but it was pretty amazing to see you fly off that tower and blow up the entire basin the thing is um there's going to be more of that i'm out of leads Farl. but i i have to keep searching and fast and whatever risks i have to take i will and it doesn't make sense to have someone with me someone who might get hurt this is on me, Farrell. Nobody else. Hold on. Before, in Meridian, you said there was a man who helped you. Silence. You said you used to talk to him a lot about things you discovered from the old world, things no one else understands. And he gave you the lance you used to defeat Hades. He's gone, Farrell. I haven't heard from him since the battle against Hades. Sure. But Spymaster Murad, back in Meridian, he's good at finding people, isn't he? Varl, I... <sighs> Come on, it might work. Plus, you'll get to see some friendly faces again. <sighs> okay. I... I guess it's worth a shot. We've got a long walk ahead. Actually... I've got a better idea. <laughs> Hell yeah. Savior of Meridian has returned. You earned this welcome. You saved them. Not yet. In the name of the Sun King of Vard, a royal welcome for the champion. Big way. Murad, Aloy has an urgent matter to discuss. Dashain, that makes two of us. I've sent forth hunters for weeks. The sun fall all the way to the sacred land, searching for you. Something happened at the spire. Come. I'll show you. It may happen. Hmm. Watch your step. You saved us all to be sure, but uh, we're still cleaning up the mess. It happened right after the solstice. We were able to explain it away, thank the sun. Otherwise, it might have caused a panic. <laughs> One night for less than half a minute, 
glowed an angry red. From Meridian, it looked like a trick of the light. But those who were closer, atop the light, said it could not have been a reflection. Much to my dismay, they said the light rose up from the tower's base. From that. We left everything just as it was. What do you think happened? I don't know. The Spire's supposed to send out signals, messages, for the terraforming system. But Hades tried to use it to wake up ancient war machines. I was sure I got the connection to that thing. Wait here while I check it out. Let us know what you find. Well, give me back the lance. If, uh, <laughs> I've got a bad feeling about this. I don't know. I could pull this thing out of my Something was transmitted from the top of the spire. I guess I have to find a way up there. I guess I should be flattered by the statue. It feels wrong. Especially when my job's only half done. I might be able to climb up the scaffolding at the base of the spire. She looks even stronger than the statue does. Oh, wait, there's more stuff down here. like a memorial. Honoring those who fell in the Battle of the Alight. Lots of brave people defended this place from Hades. Machine carcasses. Remnants from the Battle of the Alight. We were almost overrun by the machines Hades controlled. But we pushed through. Okay, now I should be able to get up here. Uh, maybe I can jump to that ledge behind me. L2, X. I'm able to pull that crane closer. There we go. Uh, just a quick hi. Oh, doing Aaron Whisper. So gonna look for now. Thank you so much, Musical Care Bear. Hopefully you and Whisper are doing well. Having a good Saturday. I'll give Whisper a shout out. There we go. 
Hopefully you guys are having a good day. Getting a lot of shopping done. Whisper Whisper had to work till noon, then he had a nap, so our errands No worries. Hope like I said, hopefully you guys are having a good Saturday. Hopefully he's not overworking himself. Oh no, don't No. I gotta cross over to the spire. Looks like I can use my pull caster on that. Okay. No. There we go. Should be able to get up there now. I thought Silence was helping me when he gave me his lance. <clears throat> it looks like he tricked me. Transmitted something through the spire. Did he save Hades? Why would he do that? Well, if I can figure out where he sent it, I can track him down. Come on, get up there. Hopefully, the transmission note at the top will tell me. Uh, looks like this panel's a jar. Can I go up through the inside? Come on. Uh, getting our cats a new cat tree for upstairs. Uh, also trading Elevator? in some comic books Let's for see. Jackson's. Oh, no worries. Have a great day. Access Hopefully we can catch up later. Hopefully we can get a place. Wonder what the carjo will make of this. Hey, Melon, what's up, buddy? Give me a shout out as well. Yeah, I doing pretty well so far, I think. There's the note. My first time ever playing through it. Chilling over here. Sounds good. Sword of the far west. Bastard. Well, Aloy. I see you finally figured it out. To be honest, I'm surprised it took you so long to discover my rules. You rigged the lands to steal Hades. How could you be so reckless? Reckless? You're the one who tried to purge Hades before its precious knowledge could be... extracted. The mysterious signal that woke it, for example. But why don't one of those Gaia backups you've been having such a hard time finding? If you knew, why didn't you just tell me? I've been having problems of my own these past six months, Eloy. The difference is, I've made progress. So once your anger at my entirely necessary deception has faded, now why don't you come out here and find me in the Forbidden West and learn all that I've discovered? Oh, I'll come find you, all right. Yes. Well, then the coordinates make it simple enough. Even for you. God. 
This is a fantastic game so far. The graphics look amazing. heard good things never actually watched or played it it's not bad actually it's it's really fun so far you went inside it and it transformed almost like the day of the battle i can only be grateful that it's a stormy day few will have seen the tower change from meridian what did you discover hades the danger didn't end here it went into the forbidden west and I have to follow. I see. But that can be difficult. The West is called Forbidden for a reason. The tribe of ferocious warriors controls much of it. The Tanakh. And they allow no trespassers past its border. That said, under the Sun King of Art, a fragile peace has been negotiated. And indeed, the next embassy will take place in a day or two on the edge of the frontier. Were you to attend the gathering under his auspices, the Tanakh might grant right of passage instead of hunting you and attacking on sight. Great, just what I need. More killers. Ah, the Sun King. Aloy, it's good to see you. You left in such haste. We never had a chance to properly thank you. Can, can we show the champion the spear now? Please? It's a min. Quiet. It's true. We bear gifts. Decorum usually calls for a ceremony of offering at the palace. But I thought you would prefer a less formal occasion. Bring them, please. A Avad, this is all very kind, but I... Uth it. Vinasha. Quick. Better hand them over before she runs off again. Really? Must you? Yay, a new spear. Try it on. Do it. That's beautiful. On behalf of all the citizens of the Sundom, may these tokens remind you of our eternal gratitude. Perhaps you'd like to spend more time with your friends. Come speak to me when you're ready to depart. Okay. I need to Anything attach the to... master override to my new spear. Should be a workbench around here I can use. Is there? A7. Game's going pretty good so far. Dowager Queen Nasadi. Blessed champion. Hopefully you're having fun with your game as well. My humblest thanks to you, great champion, for delivering my mother and me from Sunfall, and for defending our holy city against the forces of shadow. Did I say right? You said it fine, Edmund. And you're <laughs> welcome. Champion, will you teach me how to shoot like a real machine hunter? It's a man. I, uh... I have to go on an important mission, Prince. To save the world? Something like that. But when I come back, I could give you a few tips. It would be an honor. <laughs> it is we owe you our lives, Champion. Speak. And we will not forget. May the sun light your way. Watch out for Thunderjaws, Champion!
The sculptor wanted something even bigger, twice the size, covered in gold and jewels. But I was quite certain you wouldn't appreciate that. You were right. I'm sorry, Avad. It's good to see you, but I can't stay long. I see. I had hoped you'd remain in the city for a time. Perhaps at the palace. Meridian's still in danger. But it's bigger than that. To put things right, I have to go west. To Noct territory. By the sun, that's a Noct? Well, perhaps Murad already told you, but... After years of hostility, we've negotiated a truce. In hopes of a lasting peace. Another embassy will be held in just a day or two. Um... What makes this coming embassy so special? Well, just like today, it is special because of the guest. Our delegation will meet with the Tanakh just outside Baron Light. We'll give them treasure, and they'll return a prisoner. Fashav, one of our finest soldiers. Soldier? Don't you mean raider? No, not in this case. Fashav is my cousin, nothing like Helis and his ilk. He joined the Western Expedition with the hopes of reining in certain excesses. But he was captured during a heroic defense of our forward base at Cinnabar Sands. And has been held ever since. Do anything uh, else fun, you guys? Uh, Melon, Seven, doing anything fun today? Um, I'm going to go ahead and talk to you. I need to get going. Uh, one moment, Aloy. There's something I must ask you. Since you left, I've thought of little else. This isn't really the time. But it has to be. Grinding on... The way you left before, there's... Hell yeah. No way uh, no nothing that's planned? Well, hopefully you guys are I'm having a good day, though. I'm not trying to stop though. you. Or hold you back. But I need to know. When your mission is over, will you return to Meridian? And stay? Long enough for us uh, to we'll be going things while spend waiting time in the placement room. I, I get, get to that. know each yeah. other properly, perhaps. Um, let's do let's do love. I do hope to see Meridian again, I thought, and you. This mission, it's my life. It's all I can think about. I have to stay focused. What happens after? I can't imagine that. I, I wouldn't know where to begin. Well, if that place were to end up being Meridian, know that you will always receive a boundless welcome here. Tend to your mission, Aloy. I will hope for your success and look forward to your return. Okay, I need to find a workman table. Is there a fucking. I don't think there's one over here. Uh, there's so many game modes and. Yeah, there, there's so many. It's part of the Deathbringer we defeated. Have a good this machine was yeah, there, the there's so many different. There's a uh, zero build, of course, the original Battle Royale. They killed me, but it's just a piece of scrap now. There, there's also like different, like uh, different like things you can actually do now, play, and well, actually, it's honestly a lot of fun. Go up here. There's something up here. Meridian I'm owes you a debt it can never repay, Savior. There. Ah, my work. Here we go. Hopefully, you got a dub so far, uh, PG. Spear upgrade. Craft. So, my new spear has been crafted. 
Master override installed. Worse? Luthid. Fanasha. Thanks for being here. Wouldn't miss it. Even if you did uh, leave Kibber us hanging such a the pain. big battle. Fanasha, stop. Wow, Whisper. She's here now, isn't she? For the moment. But I see that look on her face. She's got business to attend to. Hopefully you don't want to see that. Yeah. You know, I didn't finish before because I wanted to. I had a huntress. Please. You don't have to justify yourself to us. You saved our butts. If you've got to go, go. With our blessing. Always. You both look like you're doing well. Mr. Shiny Pants here is now the Sun King's senior military advisor. That means people actually have to be driving so I can get away with it. Wow, it's sorry souls. At least I say something of substance every Just wait, I'll, I'll tell Kerber later. What was that? I just fell asleep while you were talking. And how about you, Vanasha? I've been looking after Nasadi and Edaman, two parts bodyguard, one part bad influence. Huh. The bad I was influence. gonna say nanny, but I like your version better. I never pictured you as a nanny. Edaman must be special. Hold on now. I'm not entirely domesticated. Nasadi was the mad Sun King's wife. She has enemies. I've had to foil a plot or two. Right. You can try to hide it, but inside, you're as soft as a silk pillow. Oh, you have no idea. Huh? Oh, dear. Uh, we were talking about Edaman? Yeah. Okay, I admit it. Edaman's cute. He's <laughs> fun. And he looks up to me. I like him. Except when he forgets to wash his hands after hooking worms in that muddy garden behind a solarium. Blech. <sighs> well, I, I know. I know. You're out. Go! Away with you. She told me Always to get on my champion. <laughs> Always a wow. pleasure. But please, little hunter, come whisper. back someday and tell us about your adventures. If I can't get in trouble, at least I can hear about yours. Just wait till we redeem the spoon later. I know you see me. Oh no. Yes, hi. What? Well, that's everyone. I guess it was nice to catch up for a little while. Yeah, uh, wish was on Kerber's account. Yeah. Keep at it, everyone. The savior of Meridian. Well met. What you looking at? What? Who the fuck is talking? Are you finished with your friends, or do you need more time? Uh, I don't think there was anything else I needed to do, so time to go. I better get going. And if I'm headed west, it sounds like I'll need right of passage Anarchy? from the Tanakh, wow. as you said. Where exactly is this embassy going to be held? Past the Daunt, the canyon that marks the western border of the Sundom. You'll find the fortress of Baron Light at its farthest edge. The embassy will take place just beyond its gates. It's a long march, a fortnight on foot. 
A couple of days hard riding should get us there. Actually, it might be better to rest here tonight. Head out in the morning. Of course. I'll arrange it. Gonna do like a long save again. So we left the dude there. We left Borrow. Am I the one to hold this crown of ash and salt? Their kindness calls to me. I have to block it out. My voice has grown so somber These words don't seem like mine But the iron won't subside No matter, no matter what I try I gotta say, this actually might compete with Detroit Become Human, one of my favorite games. Let's go! The Forbidden West. Thank you all of you who are spending your Saturday hanging out with me. I really do appreciate it. Sparks to steal. Never seen anyone use one of those to get around. Is that how I get to Baron Light? Uh, yes, I mean, usually, but not today. Uh, not yet. And why is that? Well, the Daunt. The whole valley. It's infested with machines. Well, shit. I can handle machines. Oh, I'm sure you can, but uh, I'm under strict orders not to operate until the whistle down at Chainscrape sounds the all-clear. 
Look, I didn't come all this way just to stand around and wait. I'll crank that car down myself if I have to. Well, but then... Who would crank it back up? Fine, fine. Though, should anyone ask, it might be best to say you forced me. I mean, I can give you a black eye if you want that. I see smoke, but not a lot of activity. Smoke's probably coming from something the machines wrecked. As for the quiet, well, there's a work stoppage in effect because of all the fuss. What sort of machines are causing the trouble? <laughs> Nasty ones, and lots of them. Bristlebacks, they're called. The strangeness is, they're not native to the Dodge. Just showed up, all of a sudden. No hunters to kill them? Well, we've got hunters, just none that want to cross Olvent. Boss of Chain Scrape. He is self-appointed. Hi, Care Bear. It's his idea. Whisper was being mean. Yeah, we should get him with the spoon. Passing through. Got an embassy to attend. You should have said that ain't gonna happen no time soon. What are you talking about? Hear that? That's your answer. Who is that? Karja Sun Priest. Cranked him down yesterday, about an hour before the machine trouble started. He's a very important man, or so he says. That embassy at Baron Light, he's the one supposed to run it. Ah! Great. If you don't do as I say immediately, the Sun King himself shall hear of your insolence. Thanks to you, I was forced to spend the night shivering in the tent, exposed to attack. I might have died. Oh, me you refuse to transport, but not this. Ah, uh, no. A Dairy Queen getting what? ice cream? This oh, are you getting a blizzard? Girl. This savage? Besides, Scallywag. Wadis. That's Aloy. Studious Wadis. Aloy, you know, savior of Meridian. Really? Well, that lessens the insult, I suppose. I came here for the embassy at Baron Light. Way I hear it, so did you. Well, not with the valley infested. And so did Aramon proclaim the sun priests most precious and worthy of safekeeping. See, scripture. I shall head to Baron Light when the captain of the vanguard tells me the way is clear, and not a moment sooner. What kind of a uh, blizzard are you getting, Care Bear? Anything Captain's good? a friend of mine, you know. I, I really enjoy the M&M blizzards. Where is Erend? Uh, Wouldn't mind speaking to someone a little more action, a little less scroll. Vadis, studious Vadis. Studious Vadis sent Erend and another vanguard out at daybreak to clear the way. And so at daybreak. Hey. Shh. It's like, bro, shut then? up. Yeah, said they check the ruins on the left bank for tracks. Take it from there. Okay. I hear there's a work stoppage. Any way to upgrade my gear? I'll bet the Smith and Chain Scrape would let you use his workbench. As for the bristlebacks, you might want to craft some acid arrows. Hitting their canisters with those will take them down Poppy quick. Poppy crisp caramel Thanks. macchiato. I'll find Aaron and I'll. That sounds very good. Hey. Where the fuck are you going? Where do you think you're going? What? To the top Hell of the yeah. Ridge? To wait in safety. Sorry. Operators under strict orders. No passengers till the whistle blows, right? That's right. <laughs> Best start cranking. <laughs> Why? Why? Jorf, would you kindly escort Studious to James Grape and wait for me there? You got it. I yeah, get the fuck out of my sight. I'll clear a path. But after that, no more excuses. Baron Light. Embassy. Yeah, the fuck out of my way. It will be. How are you liking the second game? I'm honestly enjoying it so far. I'm 
Uh, I like I, I think this might compete with the trip become human. Good to hit chain scrape first and upgrade my bow. I'm really enjoying it. Oh, okay, that's a scanner. Let me scan. Thank you. I I'm noticing a big difference. Or not not very a big difference, but more of a there's there's a few controls that are completely different than the first game. So I am noticing that. I mean, especially since I just played the the first game last week, so I am noticing a few buttons that are completely Stuff different. For the stash. All right, let's see. I'm going to manual save. New game. Cool. I did hit him. Okay. Thank you. I was like, I know I hit him. I've learned to override machines and cauldrons before. I wonder if there are any other. Okay, here. so did I miss the bench? Hold you up, you fucker. Where's this bench? Find Erend. Go to Erend's last known location. Okay. What do you want me to go to the upgrade bench? Oh, okay. Whatever. We'll go this way. Yeah, I think they try to streamline the buttons. Yeah, this, I mean, like, the streamline isn't bad, but at the same time, like, I kind of wish they would have kept some of the same buttons. It's not bad. I mean, it's just going to take me a couple games, like, a couple weeks to learn. Those machines must have turned into this camp. This valley definitely isn't safe. Uh-oh. Ow, you fucker. Ow. Yeah, I, I think it's... Be yeah, because I am playing it back to back. Pain subsiding. There he is. Yeah, I, I think it's just going to take me a a game or two, like a, a stream or two, to get used to the buttons again. Or the new buttons, at least.
But I, I am enjoying this game though. It, it, it's, it is a lot of fun. The graphics are a lot better. Ooh, what's that up there? I can miss that. I did. Okay. What is that? Green shine. Okay. Oh, it's green like blaze, but it's hard and shiny. Maybe I can make an armor out of it. You have found the green shine, a rare and valuable resource. Hidden all over the world. Green shine can be used upgrading certain weapons and oh yep, okay. Oh. This water is green, too. Let's go. Okay, go to chains. Okay, I'll go there first. That must be chain scrape. Jeruf said I could get my bow upgraded in there. I'll okay, be able to there. Tinker with my other gear too. Come in, Savior. Oh, yeah. Welcome to Chainscrape, Savior. Open up, guys. Jorf's orders. Good enough for me. Good enough for me. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, but it's like, okay. Poutine's so good. I'm, I'm honestly going to have to try a proper poutine. Petra? Aloy. What are you doing here? Uh, about time there was something worth looking at in this dump. It's nice to see you too. And not a moment too soon. Come on. I... Damn brewery's the only thing I can count on in this place. Yeah, I heard. Machines, work stoppage. Oh, those are just the latest malfunctions. Chain scrape's always been a few tools short of a kit. <laughs> and right there is the biggest tool of all. Not our problem. The bristlebacks are everybody's problem. Roland? You've heard of him. Yeah. But he's a story best told over a cold beer. Uh, Petra, Petra. I'm just passing through. I'm headed west. Oh. There's an embassy at, at Baron Light I need to make happen, and then I keep moving. Ah. Of course. Bigger gears to grind. Well, Flame Hair, good to see you. You gotta move on. Petra. But if you want a cold beer and a few laughs with an old friend, come find me at the brewery. Your choice. Oh, what the hell? Go have a cold beer. Well, this old one guy sounds like trouble. Maybe Petra could use some support. But first things first, I need to find that workbench and upgrade my bow. Alright, so... Alright, so I need to find the... There it is. Upgrade bow. Okay, so I can upgrade this. Upgrade this. Upgrade. Upgrade complete. Weapon stats improved. 
And so I now have the Acid Hunter's Bow. Should I upgrade again? Hell yeah, I just upgraded again. What do I got now? Can I upgrade again? I can! Empty coil slot. Hell yeah. Okay. So I upgraded all that. Let's upgrade this. Okay. Okay, do not have any more bristleback circulators. Okay. Can I upgrade the outfit? Okay, I can upgrade the outfit. Wait, what did I need for that? A Fanghorn Antler. Okay. I could probably get one of those. Okay, go back. Trip caster. I can craft. Okay. Oh, I can upgrade the pouches. Yeah, see, uh, if you if you notice whisper like this is completely different from the last. Any raccoon hide, squirrel bone for that, and squirrel hides. Okay, so I need to hunt squirrels, horned lizards, and a goose. Okay. Special gear. Can I upgrade any of this? Nope. Okay. Okay. The ammo that deals acid damage is now available in your inventory. You can focus scan enemies. See which weak to acid. Hitting them with acid will build up corroding state. Okay. I, I like those little pop-up things that tell you exactly what you need to do. A coil slot. Okay. Tap. Okay. This should be useful. Now I just need to find Aaron and help him clear the bristleback. Shop looks closed. Yep. Can I still use the workbench? I ain't gonna stop you. I already did, but okay. I'll have you know I am the smartest man to ever clean in exactly. So, Tia, did you mean this? And he showed me a flathead. You just interrupt everyone you meet, or am I a special case? Okay, what's this? Oh, okay, it's the uh right, this is the stash can be found in early settlement. We still have a score to settle, don't we? Expecting you. Can I help? Get the feeling you're itching to go out west. A lot around Forge. Well, how am I supposed to? Okay, he's locked. Next on me. Bit early for you to be up and about. Okay, so let's... Where was that unknown? 
way up there. Way up there. Okay, I'm not there yet. Uh, there is an unknown right here. Can I get up this way? I can't. Heading home in a few, we'll catch you back when I get- No worries. Get home safe. Where... Did I already get it? Okay, I did. There. My cup is empty. Hey, Mildef. Mildef. I took some of your stew last time I went into the wild. It kept me going for a week. I felt like I could have put a strider in a sleeper hole. Enjoy it while it lasts. Sounds like you're serving up some uh, impressive provisions here. <sighs> Not a can. You can have the discount too, but you'll have to come back later. I think you have me confused with someone else. Oven didn't send you? No. Oh, my apologies. It's just that his minions won't stop pestering me. <sighs> now I've even worn out my special grill. Since I'm in the midst of a crisis, perhaps you could skip to what it is you wanted? Some of your food? Of course. Uh, about the food. Your last customer mentioned your cooking really kept him going out in the wild. Where I'm headed, I could use some of that. I would be happy to oblige, especially since you have the decency to ask pleasantly. But? But my special groove griddle is no more. Without it, I can't cook any of my signature dishes. I hate to think what'll happen when I'm forced to refuse Olven or his goons. Even if I already had the right ingredients, there's nothing I can do. Unless you can source me a temporary replacement? What do you need? For the ingredients. A few pieces of decent wild meat, and I'd say a big handful of bitter leaf stems. That'll do. As for the griddle, a corrugated metal panel might suffice until I can have a new one forged. You'd likely find one in a scrounger pile if you follow the river to the northeast. Don't worry, I'll clean it first. <laughs> You'll have no issue finding boars and bitter leaf on your way. Assuming you're as much a hunter-gatherer as your clothing suggests. Thanks, Mildef. I'll keep an eye out. So that's what gratitude sounds like. And don't let anyone push you around, okay? If you say so. Already got enough bitter leaf. Just need to hunt for some wild meat and get... Okay, so let me do this. Oh. Or down. What? Okay. Uh, skill points are gathered by leveling up and completing quests and activities. Choose a skill tree and tap X to open it. Okay. Um, I think I want warrior. Um, okay. Learn skill. Okay. Earned. Learn all three connected skills. Okay. How many more skill points do I have? I think I have one. Yeah, I think I have one skill point left. Yeah. Okay. So I can do the Nora Warrior. R R R R. Uh. 
Okay, I could do that. Let's learn that. Okay. Confirm. Okay. Uh, machines. Hey, Sierra. Thank you so much for the lurk. Really do appreciate it. Could do a shout out as well. Welcome in. Oh, nope. Miss anything? I did not. Yeah, I did. What? What am I missing? Oh. Uh... gonna get all these it's just a basic how to play Hopefully, uh, whatever you guys are doing today, hopefully it's good. Anybody, uh, having anything good for dinner tonight? I think I'm having stir fry for dinner. Okay. The new quest up here. I'll tell you the Wait, was this the bar? For that beer after all, eh? Yeah. yeah. Sit down. Yeah. Get a pint in her hand. Wasn't expecting you to swing by. Since when do I do what's expected? Ha! There's that spark. Fire and spit. Uh, fire and spit. <sighs> That's a blast from the bellows. Won't fix the forge, but at least I can forget about my troubles for a while. Like what? Take your pick. We got bodies to bury from the bristlebacks, the work stoppage, Olvin grading the gears about his concession decree. Hey! Weapons off the table! Ah, don't listen to me. Nothing a cold brew and knocking some heads together can't fix eventually.
thought you'd be back in Freeheap. Well, after the big battle at Meridian, I went back. But realized it was running smooth. Didn't need me. Heard about the rebuilding out at Baron Light. Figured they could use another hammer. Been scraping by ever since. You could always leave. And go back east? Nah. I ain't one to leave a lit forge. Besides, someone's gotta be a squeaky wheel for the workers around here. So about Olvind? Around here, everything's about Olvind. How'd he end up in charge? He got here early, like a squirrel smelling a fat nut. He knew rebuilding barren light would need stone and timber. So he jangled purses all over Mainspring, getting investors to front claims on anything in the Daunt that might be worth a damn. Thing is, all the Again, sorry if I'm not talking much. I'm trying to enjoy the story and all and that kind of King stuff. Can revoke those claims at any well, time. hopefully everyone's having a fantastic That's day. That's why he's desperate for the Magistrate to sign off on a concession decree. This concession decree, what is it exactly? And how would it help Olvind? It's pig diddle, that's why. A writ that would put all Osram claims in the Daunt under Osram law, even though they're on Karja land. It would mean that any existing ore, stone, and timber claims couldn't be revoked by the Karja. No more risk, no more hesitation for investors back in the claim to pour in the shards and expand their business. And since Olvind has a stake in all those claims, it would make him richer than a scrapper in a junk heap. Not to mention Chainscrape would become an Osram municipality, so he could buy enough votes to call himself an elder man. He's a sly old badger, I'll give him that. Figures if he keeps up the pressure, eventually the Magistrate will sign. Well, I, uh, I have to be going. Thanks for the drink, Petra. I'm glad I stopped by. Any time, Flame Hair. <laughs> All right. So what is this? Ah, come to revel in some strike, sister. Let me set the board. I was just passing by. I... Mm, first timer, huh? Don't worry about it. I'll go easy on you. You got any pieces? Uh, no. Well, aren't you in luck then? I got an extra set, a Tanakh original, straight out of the Forbidden West. Sit, 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 sit. I'll run you through it in a hot spark. I'll give you something special if you win it on my boards, too. Okay. Begin a tutorial. Are you ready for the beginner tutorial? All right, let's start off simple. The Tanakh like to say that machine strike is a game of pure strategy. We each get a set of pieces. Each piece represents a kind of machine and each machine is worth a different number of victory points. And to win the game, you'll need to gain seven victory points by destroying the opponent's machines. Okay. It can be tricky remembering the details of every machine, so we use these notes to keep track of them. You see that number on the top right corner? Okay. That there is how many victory points you'll get for destroying that machine. Notes also tell you how far a piece can move, how powerful their attacks are, the distance they can strike from, and of course, their health. Okay. Okay, that's enough for now. Let's just play. I'll explain the rest as we go. I own the board, so I get to choose who goes first. Since this is your first time, I'll let you go. Usually you get to choose which pieces to set on the board, but this will do for now. Pick up that machine piece to your right mm -hmm, and move it forward. And remember, each machine can only move a certain distance. Take a look at your notes if you need a reminder. Gotta move that machine forward. I moved it. 
Oh, you want me to actually move it? Oh, okay. Easy enough, huh? Now, you get to move two machines each round. So go ahead and pick a second machine. Perfect. There's not much else to do for now, so just end your turn. We're forging onwards. Let me move my pieces here. And we're back to you. This time, why don't you try attacking one of my pieces? Try with that machine on your right first. Now move the piece close enough to attack one of my machines. When performing an attack, you'll be testing your... A machine's combat power is a combination of the terrain your machine is standing on and its own attack power. This board only has grassland terrain, which has no effect on a machine's combat power. And your current machine has two points of attack power. So in total, your machine's combat power equals two points. Okay. Since my machine isn't the one attacking, it has zero points of attack power. And just like your machine, it's not affected by grassland terrain. So right now, the difference in combat power between the two machines is two points. This means your machine can do two points of damage to my machine. Did you get all that? Okay. You were a smart one. Finish up by attacking my machine. Not pulling any punches, huh? Now grab that second machine of yours. See how your machine can't move close enough to attack mine? You can make your machine sprint. That lets it move one space further. Try it out. Downside to sprinting is that your machine can no longer attack. Now some players like to take a risk and overcharge their machine in cases like this. Overcharging lets you attack after a sprint, but it will damage your machine's health by two points. So use at your own discretion. Let's try doing that now so you can see what I mean. That's about it for your turn, then. Okay. And turn. Now, I'll let you in on a neat trick. That machine of yours, the one closest to me, grab a hold of it. Same as in the wilds, machines have both armored points and weak points. You can see them marked on the pieces. Blue shows where their armor is thickest. Hit them there, and you'll do some damage, but not a lot. Now, red shows the machine's weak points. Hit those, and you'll deal a mighty blow. Here, let me show you. Rotate that piece so your machine faces mine. Okay, use L. Now let that machine have it. Off the board she goes, and there's your first victory points. You don't have seven of them yet, so let's keep going. Your machine attacked mine, but hasn't moved yet. Go ahead and move downwards towards my remaining piece. You've already attacked a machine and moved your piece. But if you overcharge your machine, you can attack a second time. And by the look of your machine's health, you'd be sacrificing your piece to defeat mine. But sometimes, that can be a good thing. Overcharge your machine to attack mine a second time, and I'll show you what I mean. Ain't that a thrill? Now, because hey, your machine Maddie. is not down at the in. same time as mine, we both get the victory points our machines are worth. Good news is, since you're the one attacking, you're going to receive your victory points before I do. Which means you can reach the Welcome covenant in, seven man. victory points first. Hopefully having a good Saturday. That's why sometimes losing a piece can be the best way to end a game in your favor. Now, you'll notice you didn't get quite up to seven victory points this time. But you did destroy It's going pretty well. I'm pieces. currently doing like a little mini game that inside Horizon Forbidden West. You're the winner. That wasn't so hard, was it? Just remember to always check for the best terrain to attack from. 
You'd be surprised the advantage you can gain over an opponent like that. I know it saved my behind in a game or two. I'll try and remember that. Oh, before I forget. These are all my spare pieces. I want the savior of Meridian to have them. It's a small set to be sure. How are you doing, Maddie? It should be enough to get you in on any strike games you find out there. You might even fancy looking out for them strike carvers. They've got all kinds of unique pieces that can turn a game in your favor. Though they'll need the right materials to craft you one. Or you might find them in the wilds if you're lucky. You know, I've lost my fair share of pieces after a night of machine hunting or brew hopping. <sighs> no need to thank me. Always a pleasure to help out new strike players. Now, if you feel like playing a real game, I've got plenty of other boards. I could even teach you a few more tricks if you're up for it. Thanks. Mm. Yeah, I, was like, I think I gotta go. Okay. Let's go Come ahead and cancel. Anytime, Red. All right, let's go find this purse, this quest here. It's outside. I'm telling you, we are on the same side here, Oma. The bristle backs threaten us all. Oh, the priest. We all know the card who let the bristle. What do you want, Olbunt? Some kind of payment. My dear magistrate, you think I can be bought? If you want that whistle blown, all you have to do is have your soldiers remove the bristlebacks and sign the concession decree. Face it, what other choice do you have? <clears throat> Hi. Hi. Savior, <laughs> what auspicious timing. Might we discuss a matter of importance to the Sundom? We might. Later. Very well. I shall be waiting. So, the savior herself. Walloper of Durval, gutter of youth. Maybe. I've heard many tales of your beauty and heroics, my fierce lady warrior. Olvent Freehold, at your service. So, what could have dragged you away from the fine silks and wine of Meridian to this smudge of a settlement. Your saviorly attention must be needed elsewhere. I'm here for the embassy and- The embassy? Why, well, uh, by the forge. Ah, greater gears for greater matters. Guess that means you'll be moving on. Once I've dealt with any problems around here that need my saviorly attention. Ah, the bristlebacks, of course. Got to get rid of them if you want that embassy to take place. Well, best get to it, hey? And off you go. Not so fast. Yeah, not so fast. You ordered the work stoppage? Indeed I did. We're laborers, not soldiers. Until the Karja clean up their mess and give us the fair deal we deserve, I'm not risking Osirum lives. Fair deal? You mean your concession decree? <laughs> it's not my decree. It's on behalf of all the good Osirum laborers of this land who do all the backbreaking work while only the Karja reap the rewards. All we're asking for is the ability to share in this prosperity for a land worked by the people for the people. Right. And just how much would be your share? Only an amount appropriate to my contributions to this community, uh, of course. Mm hmm. If Chain Scrape is on Karja land, shouldn't a Karja be in charge? Who appointed you? The sensibilities of good Osram folk. Yeah, who of appointed course. you? <laughs> you think a Karja can head this whole venture? Ah! The magistrate can barely make the trek from Baron Light without losing a few screws. So you have no real authority then? People only follow you because you say so. Loudly. Loudly. Anyone who has followers has authority. I've been with Chainscrape from the beginning. 
I mean, I'm practically its founder. And its honest folk know I'm indispensable to its success. You said you founded Chainscrape. Somehow I doubt that. Practically founded, I said. I alone <laughs> saw its potential when it was just a smattering of tents and barren light shadow. Sure. I invested in the mine, convinced some friends back home to do the same, and here we are. You could say Chain Scrape is what it is thanks to me. Oh, so you're not just standing around and profiting off everyone else? Not at all. Sure, I make a little return on my investment here and there, but my main priority, as it was from the beginning, is to look after the well-being of these honest, working Osram. Mm-hmm. Where's the whistle? Right in the middle of town, but with the threat out there, I'm not endangering innocent Osram lives. I'm going to clear out the bristlebacks, and when I'm done, this valley is going to get moving. If that's what it takes. Until then, I'll keep looking after the safety of these good folk. Mm -hmm. Just be ready to blow the whistle. Just get, just blow the damn whistle. Okay, map. Here we go. Um. Okay, so I need to go do this quest up here. Let me see what that Karja magistrate wanted. I bet. He's in the tavern. Uh, duh. Okay, so that it's up here. Help Corvin and the. What happened to you? That damn mine is what happened to me. <clears throat> it won't be the last injury if Olven keeps shoving those tongs into those tunnels. What mine? Northeast of Chain Scrape. Where the river ends? I told Corvin we should stop when the first cave-in happened, but... <sighs> Olven probably threatened to cut off her pay. Or worse. How about you slow down and take me through it? You mentioned you were injured in a cave-in. Yeah, <clears throat> a couple days ago. That's how I hurt this blasted leg. <laughs> Corvin and the others were opening a new vein while I was checking on an older one. As soon as their blast hit, Tunnel I was in collapsed. Might have dodged it if I wasn't running on barely a spark of sleep. We were pushing too hard and too fast. And you're afraid Corvin and the others might not be as lucky if it happens again. Mm-hmm. Hit the nail right on the head. Who's Corvin? He's their foreman, and a damn good one. The kind that knows how to deal with management when it gets unreasonable. But Olvind, <laughs> his demands go beyond unreasonable. Corvin's been doing his best to appease him. He even blamed himself for my injury when it was Olvind who ordered the extra shifts. Sounds like a good guy. That's why we all put up with the long hours and lousy conditions. But if the whole mine becomes unstable, I'd rather suffer Olvind's wrath than die buried in rubble. I could check in on your crew, if I'm in the area. I... would appreciate that. Thank you. How goes it, Hammerhead? Okay, so I just did that quest. Okay, so I have that one, that one. Side quest, main quest. Jobs, I don't know. Okay. Got a new data point. Okay. Now let me go. Okay, so you're up in here before.
Savior, thank you for taking the time. And my condolences that you had to endure Olvan's bloviating. I've dealt with worse. It sounds like he's really trying to put you over the barrel. The idea that the Karja purposely let Bristlebacks into the Dawn, it's, it's completely absurd. But the louder and longer he says it, the more support he'll get for his damned concession decree. How did the Bristlebacks get into the Daunt? No one knows for sure. The first report of them came from west of the quarry. But unless Again, they have wings, I, I am I don't sorry if I'm not about. talking much. I'm honestly just trying mountain. to enjoy this game. It no really is a way. fantastic game. The only way I know about is Baron Light. Look, if you can get to the bottom of this, I can offer a considerable bounty in return. Help me shut Olvent up. Sure. You said the bristlebacks were first spotted west of the quarry? Yes, according to one terrified laborer, said the ground trembled before they came charging down the hillside. He took off and ran all the way here. Good place to start looking, then. If you learn the truth, maybe Olvant will stop blaming the Karja for every problem under the sun, and maybe then he'll actually focus on rebuilding Baron Light instead. Okay. So I'm going to go back outside to this campfire. I'm going to save. Manual save. Save. Yes. Am I lost or am I back okay. Now I'm going to go. Welcome back, Seven. Hopefully you're having fun with your game. We love Maddie. Yes, we love Maddie. Maddie is fantastic. Can I use this stuff now? Drink, but I'm not exactly made not of sharks, you know? It's So now I need to go. What was the quest? Bam, bam, bam. By Aaron's last location. Yes, we love Maddie. Hey, Chaos. Welcome. Give you a shout out as well. We love you, Maddie. Hopefully, you're having a good day. If you need anything, you know, you can always come talk to us. Uh, to the brink, find Aaron's last location. What's that? Unknown charger site. Who's Maddie? Uh, a fantastic person. Wow, that's a big map. What's this over here? Search the West Quarry for bristlebacks. What's this up here? Deep trouble go into the mine. Okay, well let's go here first. Maddie is a fantastic person who deserves all the love, deserves all the follows. Witchy, who are you? You look like you're itching for a fight, friend. Not right now. I gotta go do this. Huh. 
Really? Do I have to go out? Oh, come on, bro. Give me, give me over the wall. Thank you. Why are you shaking your head? Ready for anything now? You showed up. Tripwire's handy, but oh, she's not in the youngins' game. Come on over. Let me give thanks proper, like. Well, One sec, bro. Sack, bro. I see you're a practiced hunter. Took you less time to kill those scroungers than vanguards to kill one I am mighty. <laughs> so the vanguards came through here? Yeah, just a bit ago. Down that bristleback, headed south. But then those scroungers showed up to carve the carcass, as they do. Then another bristleback ran through. I'm telling you, it's crazy around here. So the vanguard went south? Probably. This whole valley is swarming with them. The vanguard seemed dead set on getting rid of them. I see. Hold on there, Red. If you're gonna go chasing across the daunt, you're gonna want a tripcaster. Yes. Not just any tripcaster. One of mine make. Free of charge. Give me my tripcaster. Your looks solid enough. Yep. I've been tweaking the design since I left Chain Scrape. More room to tinker out here and... Let's Give me a well, accidents. I should get going. Thanks for the trip, Caster. While you're blasting bristlebacks, I think I'll head down to the hunting grounds. Did you know they have a trip, Caster trial? Come by later if you want to try it out. Maybe after I get things under control. So, Aaron. 
Okay, so... Now I have a Tripcaster bow. Should be able to pick up his tracks with my focus. There, that should be enough wild meat for Moldov. playing and see yeah for another half hour yeah I'll be playing till about four o'clock Mighty thankful to you, Savior. The second, yeah, it really is. This game is really, Aaron really beautiful. You're not one for fancy titles. You're a vanguard. Well, here to escort Vardis' delicate behind to the embassy. If we can get rid of these bristlebacks. Captain said to keep an eye on Chainscrape. Then these ugly lugs showed up. Gave the first one a good beating. But didn't quite have time to roll out of the way when it fell. Told you it wasn't a good idea to eat that much before heading out. I should probably get going. <laughs> Now, if you see any more of these bristlebacks... I'll make sure to roll out of their way. Might want to take some of these with you as well. They're handy in a pinch. Thanks. Stay safe, Aloy. Come on. Time to get these machine carcasses to chain scrape. That ought to be fun. Okay, one sec. Okay, I'm gonna go down here, save, pick up. Commando save. Stay. Did he just call Aloy an escort? I have no idea. Okay, what does she give me? Oh, sleeping bags. Cool. Hmm. 
Most of these as I can. Okay, so now I need to go. Actually, let me. Yeah, let me explore the ruins. Ow. Yes, I know I'm poisoned. This isn't the matter you're looking for. These aren't the droids you're looking for. Okay, so how can I get in there? What? Why won't it let me grab that? There we go. Jesus. Looks like this door needs some kind of key module. Maybe there's one in the ruin? code for the locked door in this data, but I still need to find a key module. Give it a snag. Oh, I had it. Damn. Come on. Thank you. 
Let's back up. Try again. bring the thing over here. Oh, I think I pulled it too far. Damn. Am I what? Mm -hmm. Okay. So if I want to let me up there. some distance first. Hmm. Haven't found a key module. Maybe I should take another look around. Oh, that's right. I forgot to even look over there. Oops. looking that great. over here. Oh, come on. See, there's got to be... Okay, let me try this.
Okay, it would let me. Okay, well, let me up there. Come on, let me up to before. Onto that. Something unknown outside? Okay, let me go find what that is. Kind of struggling a little bit here. Let's see what this is over here. Vista Point Tower? Okay, well, I don't know what the Vista Point Tower does. Whatever that is. Okay. We'll, we'll find out. That's what the- okay. I got it now. I got it. I had a dumb moment. Okay, gotta find a key for the door.
too close. Probably. Come on. Key module. Ancient compartment. here. Let me go see what this compartment is out here. Then we'll take a step back. Huh. 
As soon as I figure this out, I'm going to go ahead and end stream. I gotta push it into the hole. Nothing for my pole caster to latch on to. Come on. I think this is the probably the frustrating part. It's probably something super simple too. Any ideas, Whisper? If anybody has played this game, 
like you're more than welcome to help. getting stuck now. It's fucking wood, I can just literally break it, but of course. I think I'm going to... See, it's gotta be... It's gotta be something I'm missing. It's gotta be. There's more of the ruin down here. Where really? Okay, I, I'm a dumbass. Yep. Yep, I'm a dumbass. the ledge above now. Guess I'll have to find another way up. I don't think it'll connect. Come on. I think I can pull that.
moving. Must be stuck. Oh, come on, it's literally fucking right there. Well, Caster won't work on that. One sec, I'm gonna look. I know it's kind of cheating, but... So, okay. Okay. I cheated, but oh well. Or down here. A more light down here.
Alright. Okay. Now where does this lead? Okay, let's see if this key fits. There. Looks like this needs a code, too. I think some of the data I picked up might help. There we go. I cheated, but oh well. Huh. What is this thing? Guess I'll hold on to it for now. I find a use for it later. All right. Go down here. We're gonna manually save. Hey, Thomas, we're actually just getting rid of that, bud. Um. Okay. I do really appreciate everyone coming and hanging out. I really do. Um, let's go find someone to write out to. Share the love. Um, let me check, make sure they're still going. Okay, it looks like they're still going. Uh... Oh, this is the brand new game. This is uh, Forbidden West, Thomas. I already finished Horizon Zero Dawn. It's on my YouTube channel. Okay, it looks like they're still going. So let's go give Matt Orloff some love. He's playing Sons of the Forest. I really would appreciate it. Everyone coming and hanging out with me. Here is the raid message. If you want to copy and paste that. I really do appreciate everyone coming and hanging out with me. I really do. Uh, this uh, uh, Wednesday, we'll be playing Fortnite. Trying out the new season. Stuff like that. And next Saturday will be part two of For Horizon Forbidden West. I really do appreciate everyone coming and hanging out. I really do. 
and we'll catch you guys next time. Later.